Hey guys, this is Kay here with WorkOnlineWithKay.com. And guys, I want to share something with you that um, today, you know, we have our Millionaire Mindset call every Tuesday and Thursday at uh, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And the, the basically the, the topic of the call was about how to pursue your goals and your dreams without fear. You have to be fearless in order to take that journey to pursue your dreams and your goals. Guys, I want to say one thing as a side note to that um, one thing that I've learned is that when you have a dream that you have made the decision that you're going to commit to that dream and you started taking steps on working on whatever dream that is for yourself you have to you know let me give you this analogy I remember when I had my first son and you know mothers when they have their first child they are so protective you know, they they are um, they make sure that they're eating right. Most mothers, good mothers, they make sure that they're eating right. They make sure that um, they're going to their doctor's appointments. Whatever they need to do to make sure that that baby is going to be a healthy baby. Anything that they can do within their control, they do it. And when that child is born, they are so protective of that newborn. And guys, it's the same thing with your dream. You have to be so protective of, especially when it's in its infancy stage, because you're going to have family and friends who are going to doubt your ability uh, of being able to accomplish something that is so great. And you don't need that negative talk about how, you know, it's going to be a struggle for you to pursue that dream or how you don't have the money or how you need to focus on, you know, your, your, your daily needs or your job or whatever. You don't, you don't need to expose your dream to everyone. Maybe one or two people that you really, really trust and you know someone who can really believe in you. But you cannot expose that baby to everyone because it's not meant for everyone to hear it. Wait until the dream, your, your goal has manifested itself. Then you can tell people. But when it's at, you know, in its infancy stage and you're just working on it, keep it close to yourself and um, just protect it. Protect it and make a decision. Commit to that dream because I'm going to tell you along the way you're going to have challenges. If it's something that requires money, you're not going to have enough of it. You're going to get discouraged. I mean, it's just going to be so much that's coming out, coming at you that you have to persevere and you have to have believing that God is going to um, carry you through that journey in order for you to reach your dreams and your goals guys so i just wanted to share that with you i hope that that will help someone out there because three years ago i had a dream a vision given to uh by god that actually has manifested itself this year guys i was working on a uh, workout product that i designed myself three years ago guys and it took over three years to get it to the point where it's now I'm able to sell it on, on the, in the marketplace. So, guys, I'm coming from experience. Just wanted to share that with you, and hopefully it will help someone. And, guys, I will talk to you on the next video. And if this video has helped you, like it, share it, comment, guys. I would love to hear your comments and, and if, if, if it has helped you at all, guys. Um, I will talk to you on the next video. Take care. Bye.